my name is Rachel Hutzelak. Um, I decided to talk about The Best Settler by O. Henry. I thought it was a great reading. Um, in the reading, the author talks about John A. Pascud, and in this reading, he believes that bestsellers are unrealistic and something like that can't happen in real life. Um, but in the short reading, he actually has a bestseller experience because he meets the daughter of a colonel and he wants to try to get permission to marry her. And although it might seem unrealistic through um, talking to the colonel multiple times and ma trying to make him happy and please him, he actually gets permission to marry his daughter. Um, and so the quotes that I chose from this piece were in page four. It says, for about nine seconds he had me rattled and I came mighty near getting cold feet and trying to sell him some plate glass but I got my nerve back pretty quick. He asked me to sit down and I told him everything. I told him how I followed his daughter from Cincinnati and what I did it for and all about my salary and prospects and he explained to, and explained to him my little code of living to be always decent and right in your hometown and when you're on the road, never take more than four glasses of beer a day or play higher than a 25 cent limit. At first I thought he was going to throw me out of the window but I kept on talking. Pretty soon I got a chance to tell him that a Tell him that story about the Western congressman who had lost his pocketbook and the grass widow. You remember that story? Well, that got him laughing, and I'll bet he was the first laugh those ancestors in horsehair sofas had heard in many a day. So this quote just shows how um, he was nervous at first, like how he would come across to the colonel, but after talking to him and like revealing his true self and being funny, the colonel actually liked him, which is something that might happen in a bestseller or um, just an example of a situation that might happen in a bestseller. And then another quote um, is on page five and um, Pescud states, I married her a year ago, said John. I told you, I built a house in the East End, the belted, I mean the colonial, or Colonel, is he there too? I find him waiting at the gate whenever I get back from a trip to hear any new story I might have picked up on the road. So this quote just shows again that he did end up getting permission and that he married the girl that he wanted to marry in the end. So everything worked out for him in the end. Um, and then my question is, do people enjoy reading bestsellers because a similar experience may occur in their actual lives to that of the novel? So they might relate to these bestsellers because something like that might happen in their lives because anything is possible and any situation can occur. So um, that's why people may relate to bestsellers because they're hopeful that something like that may happen in their lives, which is possible. So um, those are my ideas.